objects like AC, mobile, vehicles, trains, polybags makes our life much easier. But do you know how much it costs to other animals and birds? It costs to their lives. But at the same time, we can use these technologies to save them. In this video, we will see how technologies are helping to save and increase the population of wildlife. But before diving deep in, let's quickly hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon. This complete article is also available at www.sashankcreativity.com for absolutely free of cost. You can visit and enjoy the article. So, coming back to our main topic. The role of the technology in the wildlife conservation has become increasingly vital in recent years as human activities continue to threaten natural ecosystems and endanger countless species. Technology advancement are offering new tools and methods to better understand, protect and manage wildlife population. Remote sensing tools such as drones, satellites allow conservationists to survey vast and challenging terrains, enabling them to monitor habitats, identify potential threats, and assess population dynamics. Camera traps equipped with the motion sensor help capturing images and videos for elusive and nocturnal animals without human intervention, providing valuable data on their behavior and distribution. So let us understand one by one. The first is data collection and analysis. The collection and analysis of the data are very fundamental activity in wildlife conservation. Advanced technology like GPS, collars, tags and transmitters can be attached to the animal to track their movements and gather data on their behavior, migratory patterns and habitat use. The second is genetic monitoring. DNA analysis and genetic monitoring are crucial for understanding genetic diversity within population, assessing relations, and identifying potential inbreeding or hybridization. Third is GIS, that is Geographic Information System. GIS technology combines special data with various layers of information such as habitat types, land use, and human activities. The fourth is artificial intelligence. AI and the machine learning algorithms are being employed to process and analyze vast amount of data collected in wildlife conservation efforts. AI can identify and classify species from camera traps images, detect changes in the habitats, and predict potential threats. It can also assist in monitoring and managing invasive species which pose significant risks to native wildlife. Next is Community Engagement and Educations Technology plays a role in the engaging communities and raising awareness about the wildlife conservation. Social media, websites, and mobile applications facilitate communication and education, allowing conservation organizations to reach a broader audience and inspire action. Next is crowdsourcing and citizen science. Technology has enabled the rise of the citizen science initiative where volunteers can contribute to the data collection and analysis. Next is anti-poaching efforts. Poaching still remains a severe threat to many endangered species. To combat this, technology like anti-poaching tools such as acoustic sensors to detect gunshots, drone for surveillance and rapid response and even smart callers that alert authorities when an animal's behavior indicates distress or injuries are being developed. Next is climate change research. As climate change impacts wildlife, human life, animals, birds, and in fact all living things and their habitat. So we can use technology aids in monitoring environmental changes to save wildlife and other living things. Remote sensors, data analysis, and modeling tools help researchers study the effort of the climate changes in the wildlife, enabling them to develop adoptive conservation strategies. Next is rehabilitation and conservation of the threatened species. Advancement in the veterinary technology have facilitated the care and rehabilitation of the injured or the orphaned animals. Furthermore, assisted reproductive technology 
and gene editing hold potential for preserving endangered species facing critical population declines. In conclusion, technology has revolutionized wildlife conservation efforts by enhancing data collection, analysis, and communication. So this is all about how technologies are helping in conservation of the forest and wildlife. This complete article is available at www.sashankcreativity.com for absolutely free of cost. The detailed link is available in description. You can visit and enjoy the article. So if you like my video, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.